Hi and welcome to Dr. Mix. Today I'm going to go back to basics a little bit and explain to you what ADSR means. This is the foundation of subtractive synthesis and if you have a synthesizer or you like to use soft synths, then you really need to know this. Coming up. <laughs> Before I start, please subscribe if you haven't already and hit the bell button, it would really help us grow this channel. Thank you. So, ADSR stands for Attack, Decay, Sustain and Release. And this represents the volume of the sound as it evolves when you press A key. So, Attack is the time that it takes for the sound to go from zero to the maximum level. Decay is the time that it takes to go back to any point you decide. Sustain is how, how loud it, the sound will be when it stops uh, as the keyboard keeps on being played. And the release time is how long the sound takes to go back to zero once the key is released. So let me show you. Attack. You see, the sound goes from zero to a certain point. We can do this slower or faster, right? Now we can choose to turn up the DK and then it will go back to zero at a certain speed. Check out. See? That's what it does. And uh, we can have it faster, uh, we can have it slower like this. Or we can have it faster, like this, right? If we don't have it at all, see, it will interrupt abruptly. And um, with the sustain, you have the point where the sound stays and doesn't go below. See? And this takes place as I am holding the key, see? So you have... But when I release the key, you can hear that it goes to zero abruptly. But if I put on some little release here, then it's going to take a little time before it goes back to zero. Check out. Now it's longer. But at the same time, we can decide not to have attack at all. So the sound will start from the top and go just down. You see? Check out what happens if I only have DK. See? This is like a percussive sound. We can have a slower curve, right? Even. Or just fast. Right? Or we can uh, have the sound stop and stay at a certain level. This is typical. Th this is typical of uh, bass, for example, where you have a little bit of attack and then it, it goes to a sustain point. See? I mean, we can go down there. Or we can have a little bit of release after that. So I hope this clarifies a little bit what ADSR is and I hope you can use it for your own production and to build beautiful sounds. If you want to subscribe to this channel, which is a great idea, you can do so by clicking on this link and we have lots more videos right here and right here. So spread the Dr. Mix gospel, make beautiful music and stay inspired.